everybody depends on the, the road network. We've got about 9,000 kilometres across the whole county. Uh, on a daily basis we would treat up to about 4,500. Our guys are always first to address the severe weather conditions and it is usually very early morning or very late at night. North Yorkshire folk don't stop just because the weather's bad. Uh, essentially we need to be part of that to make sure that people can get about. The drivers are great. We've got some really, really good committed lads. You can see the conditions outside at this moment in time, really dangerous conditions, but they do a really good job. We get a phone call at lunchtime letting us know what the action is for the evening. And then if you're in the mornings, you also get told at lunchtime. We turn in about three quarters of an hour before we're meant to go out. So you get time to do your vehicle checks and load up with salt, and make sure everything's okay. Then you head out and do your route, usually about an hour and a half to two hours long, depending obviously on the weather and traffic conditions. And then you're back into the depot, um, a quick wash off, unload the wagon and uh, you're on your way home again. Last night we were out at nine o'clock, which out. So we did our P1s at 20 gram last night, then back in, then home, and back for three o'clock this morning. Set off again at 20 past three this morning. Did our P1s at 20 gram again until we got them nice and black. Um, in terms of winter, basically, the day before, we receive uh, instruction from the client of what we're doing that day and the following morning. And it's my job to implement that instruction with our workforce. I have to manage the working hours of all the operatives. Well, we started at three o'clock this morning and it's been very, very busy. It's a fun job. I absolutely love my job. Uh, we get to play with snow plows in the snow. Who wouldn't want to do that? It's a it's fantastic job. Priority one routes we undertake to grit by seven o'clock in the morning. Uh, priority two routes then are ones that we will grit uh, by ten o'clock in the morning. And then the others, priority three routes, tend to be minor rural routes, residential estate roads, that we will grit eventually uh, if, if there is a prolonged period of, of icy weather. It's quite exciting when you've, you've got the, the snow plough down um, and you, you're pushing snow out of the way. Um, it's often quite difficult to see where you're going or where the edge of the road is. And if it's quite deep snow that you just simply can't get through. And the county do have a, a team of farmer contractors with, with tractors. The farmer contractors, they've been on a long time as well, uh, going well back. Um, it's almost passed down from generation to generation with some of the contractors and farmers. They were very good backup. We are one of the farm contractors that are called in in extreme conditions to help out on the roads. We use side blades, gritters, and often, if it's really bad, the um, V blade. Don't mind helping out in, in any way from farms. Um, it makes you feel part of the community. It uh, it keeps keeps things going. The guys do a sterling job. I've got to say they're brave to go out there in these conditions. They're the first line of defence for the public when they're gritting out there and they're the first people to hit the conditions.